America's number one adventurer, K-7, former United States secret agent who operated in 22 countries on land, on sea, and in the air, brings you a story of today. We take you to secret agent K-7's headquarters. This is K-7 speaking. Send in Special Agent M for assignment. At once, K-7. Special Agent M, reporting for duty. Agent M, a few weeks ago, the notorious spy, Manuel Groenhoff, entered this country. He came from the Orient. Secret Service men traced him to this naval base, but here his trail was lost. I think you are familiar with his background. However, here are some additional facts from my personal records. Study them. I want you to get Groenhoff. That's all. Keep me informed. Manuel Groenhoff's appearance at the naval base was not accidental. At the very moment K-7 was talking to Agent M, the master freelance spy faced an Oriental whose bearing was that of a military or naval officer. Everything is in readiness. I located an abandoned warehouse and rented it yesterday afternoon. You can bring in your cargo whenever you are ready. Uh, good. We will act tonight. The weather is what we have waited for. And how about the Coast Guard? It has been arranged to lead them to other parts. Let us take care of everything, don't you? It is often wise to be cautious. You have done your work well, Gronhoff. Now I will give you your instructions for tonight. A small fishing boat will enter the harbor about midnight. The drums of chemical will be aboard. And how are you going to get them ashore? You will supervise that. Several small boats, which belong to my people, will be put at your disposal. They will report to you at the old warehouse. At midnight, send them out to me offshore. Each boat will return with ten drums. Your job will be to see that the drums are carefully stored. That will not be difficult. What do you want me to do after the chemical is ashore? You will remain here and keep out of sight until we are ready to strike. That is all. I see. Uh, when are you going to let me know what this is about? I'm not used to working in the dark. The government usually gives me full information before I begin. Yes, but this time I have waited until now. Until now? You have never worked with me before. I was not sure you would be willing to continue if you knew what we planned. Go on. This country cannot strike against us except through its navy. We are going to destroy the fleet. Destroy the fleet? But that is impossible. I think you will see differently when I explain. These drums we bring ashore tonight contain a new chemical. When combined with salt water, our secret chemical will eat its way through the thickest steel within a few hours. Do you mean it will eat the bottom out of a ship? Exactly, my friend. Our chemists have worked on the formula for many years. Next week, the fleet returns here. As soon as all the battleships are at anchor, you will pour the drums of chemicals into the water of the harbor. Within a few hours, the fleet will be useless. The battleships will sink to the bottom of the bay, their bottoms eaten out. Sashi, are you telling me the truth? If you are not... I am not accustomed to being doubted. Chemical that will eat the bottom out of a battleship and combine with seawater? Why, why, your country can rule the world. That is our destiny. Now, I leave you. Be at the warehouse at midnight. <laughs> A new secret chemical that, when poured into seawater, would eat through the steel bottom of a battleship. The plot was a desperate one. The fleet was threatened. That afternoon, Yvonne studied the records of Groenhoff's career as a freelance espionage agent. As she went over the files, Agent M worked different wavelengths with a shortwave radio receiver. I've finished, M. Uh, wait, Yvonne. Don't talk now. I'm taking this message down. Now, 
Now, uh, what you say? I finished reading K. Seven's personal records on Gronholf. I don't see where we're going to start this case. We've already started. What do you mean, Em? I had a hunch and played it, Ivan. That's why I've been listening on different shortwave bands. That message you just heard may give us the lead we're looking for. You think it has a connection with Gronholf? I don't know. The message came from a nearby and powerful station. Well, what did it say? That's what we're going to find out. It's entirely in code. And a code that I don't know. Then how are you We're great... going over to intelligence headquarters and talk to L6. He's the greatest code authority in the world. I think he'll be able to decipher this, this one. Are you ready? Yes. Then let's get started. Unless I'm mistaken, Ivan, this case is going to bring us face to face with the rising sun. <laughs> That night, a small fishing boat without running lights dropped anchor far out in the harbor. Immediately, guarded lights flashed around the old warehouse. The drums of the mysterious new chemical began going ashore. Yvonne watched from behind a pillar of a rotting wharf. Five small boats have come in. I've got to signal M. He may not have found out that the boats are there in the darkness. He told me not to use my flashlight unless I had to, but I've got to signal him. Three long flashes with a signal to come ashore. Stand where you are. If you attempt to move, I will shoot. A girl. Who are you? That is a question I would like you to answer. What are you doing here? I, I, I came off for a walk. I often come down I here. don't believe you. What were you doing with that flashlight? Well, I, well, I heard a boat out there in the darkness. I thought perhaps someone was lost. I couldn't see any lights, and... Well, it might mean someone was in trouble. You are the one who is in trouble. Don't come any nearer. I'm on the edge of the dock. You are coming with me. Oh, don't try that. Let go. a splash as a body disappeared below the surface of the dark water. A few minutes later, the Oriental who had talked with Groenhoff came ashore with the last boatload of the drums. That is all. You will return to your home. Yes, master. I will stay here and return to the city with Groenhoff. Instruct the others to go back to their homes. Some have already gone. I will tell the others. Where is Gornhoff? You'll find him across the dock. Good. That is all. Go. Gornhoff. Stand where you are. Don't attempt to call out. Who are you? What are you doing here? I'm Special Agent M. I place you under arrest as a spy. You have made a mistake. I don't think so. I intercepted your radio message this afternoon. I heard you order a fishing boat to come ashore with some chemical tonight. I think you've got a few things to explain to our authorities. Now turn around till I get your gun. Don't try anything. You will regret this. Perhaps. But I'm going to have the satisfaction of hearing you explain what is in the drums you brought ashore and why you smuggled them in. Now, walk straight ahead. If all of you attempt to move up... Yvonne! Em... I couldn't see you in the darkness. Who is this man? Unless I'm mistaken, he's the man who hired Gronoff, Yvonne. He came ashore with the last load of drums. He's under arrest. Em, I know what's in those drums. I heard two of the men talking. It's a chemical to be poured into the water of this harbor. And when it's combined with seawater, it becomes strong enough to eat the bottom out of every battleship anchored here. I've heard rumors of such a chemical. Now, here, keep this man covered. I've got to find Gronoff. You won't have to, Em. He tried to seize me, and in the darkness, I hit him over the head with my gun. He fell into the bay. That leaves just one thing more for us to do. Then we'll take this officer to the naval authorities. Where are you going? I'm going to destroy the warehouse. Officially, I wouldn't dare. I'm going to act unofficially and burn it to the ground. The chemicals it contains are too dangerous as weapons of war. M. We 
spy, Manuel Gronoff, working with a certain eastern power, attempted to land 100 grams of a dangerous new chemical, which was to be used to destroy our fleet. The chemical was brought ashore. However, the warehouse in which it was stored was destroyed by fire. Now, I saved one drum for analysis by our chemist. All else was destroyed. I have one prisoner. Grown up is believed dead. I am sending you a confidential report. The case is closed. Sea power is of extreme importance today, and there have been many plots against the fleets of the great democracies. However, the democracies still rule the seas and champion the cause of peace. Listen for my next story. This is K7 speaking. Thank you.